Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. In this video, I would explain how to execute remote commands or scripts using SSH. So in the diagram, we have two machines. One is client machine and there is server machine. Here, I would like to execute some of the shell commands or scripts in the server from client machine. So, the prerequisites for this is we have to set up passwordless authentication from client to server. So, how to do that? So, we, ha we have to create a private key and public key in this client machine and copy the public key to the server. And then we can connect from client to the server using without any password. Once we establish passwordless authentication from client to server, then we can execute commands in the remote machine from client without logging into the server. So let us start. So we have two machines. One is client machine and this server machine. So log into client machine. The first step should be we have to generate private key and public key inside the client. So let me generate using SSH keygen. FNT RSA, we can give number of bits as 2048 or 4096. Here I am giving 2048. And we have to choose the path where we have to store uh, the private key. So I'll keep the default one. And also we can give the passphrase. So I am giving empty phrase. So now the keys are generated. We can go to dot SSH directory and verify whether the keys are generated. So here we have two keys generated, one is private key which is IDRSA and another is public key. So we have to move the content of this public key, copy the public key to the server, we can use SSH copy ID command, SSH copy ID. So we have to provide the target username, here I am using test user in the server and also 10.0.0.72. So this is the IP address of the server, you can also provide the host name of the server as well. So enter. So for the first time connection, it will offer the host public key. So let us accept it. Provide the password of the user. So now it is displaying the number of keys added is one. That means our public key of the client is added to the authorized keys of the server. So let us verify the same in the server. So let me open here id rsa dot public key. This is the content. And we can we should see the same content in the server always this file. So this is the test user in the server. So go to SSH. We can see always this file here. And this is the same content as in client. So that means our public key is successfully copied to the server. So now let us verify the SSH connection without any password. SSH test user great n dot two dot zero dot 72. So this did not ask any password to enter. So that means our passwordless authentication from client to server is successfully established. So in the next step, we have to execute the SSH commands in the server from client itself. So, so we can use the same command. So here I can give any uh, shell command, for example, post name. So this should display the host name of the server. So this is successfully displaying the host name of the server. That means we are able to successfully execute the commands in the server from client. So let us try to create a shell script in the server and we'll execute the shell script now. So go to the server and go to the home directory of test user. Here I will give test.shh file. So this is a very simple script uh, with one command. So let me save this. So the, the file is saved. Let us give execute permission for this. So now we have given execute permission. We can test the script here itself first. So it is printing hello world. This is SSH server. So let us try to execute the same shell script from client itself using SSH. So we have to give the same command except by changing this one. Provide the full path of the script in the server. Home test user. So now we are successfully able to execute the script in the server from client itself. So this is the way how we can execute the shell commands in the server from client using SSH. So we can extend this to uh, very complex scripts as well. So this is a basic example. So I hope uh, you like this session. If you like the video, 
please like share and subscribe